This Ridleyo is sponsored by LRN.FM. Edge don't want you to hear them. Chief, question for you. Did you guys send units to Watertown during the bombing crisis? Yes, we did. Uh, did you give them any special instructions to you know, limit them from violating people's Fourth Amendment rights? They were while they were in control of the authorities down there. That's all I can say. About that. Would they have done more down there than, a, than they would have done in New Hampshire in terms of being aggressive, going well, into people's were, houses? They were, uh, I don't know what they trained to do, and they were following the instructions of the government was in emergency. Do you have any sense of whether Massachusetts police would come here and do something like that here in a similar circumstance? I think if the circumstances were uh, an emergency, certainly could. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Steve. Are you still recording? I beg your pardon? Red light stolen. You should always assume. You said thanks. You said you thanks. Always, you kept on recording. Yeah, you should assume that I'm always recording. I'm always <laughs> I look forward to the day when I don't feel like I have to. <laughs> I said Captain, but Ed, did I just promote you? Actually, no, I haven't okay. seen your badges yet. I've got a question for you. I understand that uh, the MPD has been arresting, uh, or not necessarily arresting, but stopping people for jaywalking, inciting them. Is that true? Uh, I'm not aware of that. There was an article in the Union Leader, I guess it was about a year ago, where three people got stopped for jaywalking, and one of them was arrested and had his drugs stolen by MPD. Is that the sort of thing doesn't happen, or...? I don't believe it happens, but I, I don't know what you're talking about, particularly. So normally if you don't. Was an, well, no, if there was an accusation made about that particular thing, I'm not aware of that. You, you don't normally arrest people for jaywalking? I, I, I guess I would leave it up to the discretion of the officer at the given time. If, if a pedestrian walks out in front of a moving vehicle, not in a crosswalk, I mean, I think it's something that should be addressed, but... Um, Certainly not just uh, targeting pedestrians trying to cross the street. That's not something that's good because I do it a lot. <laughs> yeah. well, you know, it's all it's all within reason. I think discretion is probably the most important word I could use. All right, I, I would hope my officers are using discretion. Okay, well, I'm using discretion with my exposure here, and it's not working out very well. So you're going to look a little brighter than you really why are. Why do you say? Why do you? I was going to ask you. Can you at least cut <laughs> the light off? Well, I could, but then do you look like this, which is. Um, I don't know if it's better or worse, it's kind of... No, either way, I'm not a very good looking guy, so... Well... You know, you'll get a lot to work with. We have the same hair, so I can't complain. <laughs> all right, thanks, and was it Captain, or...? Uh, assistant Chief. Assistant Chief, okay, all right. And all right. you're David Ridley? Correct. Mr. Nice Willard, good nice to meet you. you. All right, I'm going to find you online before. easy enough. Yeah, that's true. I, I, you don't even look familiar to me for some reason. I've seen some of your... Uh, what, what do you call them? Segments. They're hard to miss. Yeah. That's the idea. Yeah. I particularly like when you make the bubble sounds and make the fish go across the screen. Yeah, well, everybody else likes it when I talk to cops and they don't like the fish. Oh, really? Yeah, that's correct. Yeah, that doesn't make sense. Just the fact that you're a cop will get this an additional 500 hits. Really? Yeah. Now, if you were trying to arrest me, it would be an additional 5,000. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> no reason to do that. Well, uh, you never know. Almost everything's illegal now. Well, this isn't. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think it is. <laughs> Our conversation is not illegal. That's good. All right. Thanks, Chief. You are. I mean, uh, thanks, no, Assistant Chief. That's okay. It's better than Captain. Yeah. Promoting you is better than demoting you. <laughs> Nope. Can't do that. 
do that. Federal agents on the streets of Keene, New Hampshire. They're investigating reports of an unlicensed radio station said to be broadcasting LRN.FM. So why all the fuss? What is LRN.FM? Well, it's probably not something these agents want you to listen to. It's a 24-hour news talk broadcast, all pro-liberty. A true authoritarian free zone. Tune in at LRN.FM to listen or broadcast their signal. LRN.FM Feds don't want you to hear them.